If you tell someone you like them and they don't share your feelings, it doesn't have to be awkward. It doesn't have to be uncomfortable. It doesn't have to be anything other than what it is. One person who just doesn't share your feelings at this particular point in time. That might change, it might never change, but too many of you judge your value based on someone's response when it's just one person and there are lots of other people. And why that person's interested or not interested could have nothing to do with you being attractive and interesting and dynamic and charismatic. It could be they're dealing with personal issues or maybe you're the wrong gender or maybe they're in another relationship or maybe they think you're too good for them and you're out of their league and they're too afraid of dating or they're just nervous because they've never been in a relationship before. The better you can get at rejection, the more comfortable you can be with rejection. When someone doesn't give you what you want, you can be cool, you can be happy, you can be grateful, you can smile, you can even say thank you, I'm really happy to know. It's important for me to know the truth. And the more comfortable you are with rejection, the more curious they're gonna be, because they're gonna be like, why wasn't that person more upset? And it's because you know that you're gonna be okay no matter what, because you're interesting, you're dynamic, you're charismatic, you're intelligent, and you know anyone who gets an invitation to be in your life is one of the luckiest people in the world. You'll be okay, you'll be more than okay. It doesn't have to be awkward, uncomfortable, or embarrassing. It could just be what it is.